Welcome back, guys. Today we have Melanchthon's, Melanchthon's Iron Dragons in the green versus Coffee Break. Who designed Coffee Break? Um, not too, oh, it's Cafe Myers and uh, there's another another guy. I don't oh, remember. Okay. I thought so. That's a Coffee Break. All right, so let's take a look at Melanchthon's team. We have a Lancer with speed save and two hands. I can do a lot of damage. Oh, sorry. Uh, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, Pawnee the Summoner defense up magic. What's on magic? All right. Chandra, another summoner. This one with Hamido and May May up. Double summoner. <laughs> <laughs> and a mine. So that's triple summoner. <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right. Now for this next team, we got Jabba the Geomancer, Mocha the Knight, Typica the Summoner, and Bourbon the Chemist. Nice. I like how that one knight has <clears throat> the knight go back. Yeah. Hamido and, and a spear, too. So it should be an interesting counter that Lancer. Yeah, I was thinking maybe he would just be better with a Lancer overall, but we'll see. Oh. Okay. Yeah. The map we're going to be going to is uh, number 25, Yardo Fort City. So this is where uh, Rafa and Malak are, first time you encounter them. All right, good luck for the teams. And again, Melanchthon's Iron Dragons in green, Coffee Break in brown. Perfect colors. Yep. All right. So right off the bat... Unless something gets petrified, which it did. <laughs> Some, the triple summon is going to be super nasty right now. Because they're going to be bunched up. You're, you're going to be able to catch at least a couple of units with those summons. And with that haste, that's just the perfect recipe right there. Look at that. Uh, uh, we're going to see one summon for 300 damage average. Another for 200. And it's going to get mimicked too. It might triple catch that uh, ge uh, uh, black, ge Geomancer. Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> Holy shit! 84, and then a mimic for the first one, and then the Geomancer is gonna do what exactly? Don't move! Oh wow, she don't don't move two people. Leviathan is not locked on her. Wow, those summoners! Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit! Can you explain to me what that summoner has? We've got to look at that next match. All the items, sure. Holy shit! 350 damage average, and Geo's gonna. The Geo's build for that, that's... <laughs> that, that was a Shiva too. Wasn't that a Shiva? Yeah, she had ma magic attack up, I think. That's why I think she did so much damage, along with MA stacking. Uh, 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 but that's also the map. Yeah, that's true. It's also the map, yeah. Alright, let's but take a look at them. No, yeah, that one. 15... Yep. So that's effectively a 20 MA right there with the magic attack up boost. Yep. And then Shiva, Shiva, Rama, Ifrit, and Fairy. That's why Fairy is doing 200 from a heal. My god. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty powerful. Yep. Alright. Alright, let's the second match. Yeah. See what uh, Coffee Break does. Yep. It's going to be map 97, inside gate of Lasalia. They're a little bit spread out this time. They're not in clusters, so they're like maybe Big three panels pack. away. Mm hmm. Yeah, this is it's gonna be harder to land summons here and the teams are split up, so Coffee Break should have an easier time winning this. Mm -hmm. uh, especially if they can get a petrify like they did. That was pretty good. Okay, no stop. And a speed save on Lancer, that's not good. And a charge stop, which the mime's not gonna do much about that. Lancer's gonna jump. And we're gonna see Super Aggro Summoner jumping right in there. Wow. And a dance. She dancing? Okay, so maybe giving giving dance to that summoner might not have been, been that good because she's built for attack, right? Like what? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And the stop is gonna go off on the mime. Yep. I think I think coffee break. I'm gonna give this one a coffee break. No stop. Although speed save lancer is very strong. Yeah, coffee break definitely at the advantage here against a lancer and a stopped mime. Ooh, and this paralyzed could change shit. Yes, yes, yes. So oh, don't act on the night, but still, it's it is pretty much four v one. Yeah, it's over. Yeah, wow, decisive victory, coffee break, pretty good. I think uh, last round, even I was just kind of surprised last round how that petrify even went off, and uh, Mel still got the victory with uh, the petrify and the lancer. Maybe if one of the. Uh, the petrified units was the was the uh, summoners, then it would have been made a difference. Probably. Yeah, but 
Yeah. Coffee break tonight. Okay, good. We're gonna go for the third match. Uh, is our third match on a medium map? Yes, a medium sized map. Okay. We're going to, uh, what is it? Okay, we're gonna be going to Checkerboard Land 3. I think this one has water this time. Yeah, 119. Two rounds done in five minutes, Jesus. <laughs> well, it was the first round with the Shiva that lasted two seconds. Yeah, slugfest. Also, here we have a lot of elevations, but still, you can still get summer summoners down. Uh, summon, sorry. Yeah. So, fall. Uh, no dumb moves going off. It's all water. It's interesting. It's pixelated water. <laughs> and another stop. Okay, so this stop could be nasty. The Lancer opting not to go for physical attack, going for the jump instead. And the Knight's going to go for status. The summer is going to do massive damage. 199 combined with another summon, 294. Knight's definitely not going to survive that. Paralyzed, though, on the mime, yeah. It's going to prevent the mimics. Did you see that blade grass go off on the... Yep. Wow, a ton of damage, yeah. Ooh, but the other summoner got taken down before she could do anything. Uh, Coffee Break might have this, man. I think he does, because both of the damage dealers are down. Well... Oh, the summoner is the speed save Lancer still alive. <laughs> Kara is going to go off on the Lancer. Wow, Coffee Break. Holy shit. Coming Coffee back. Co yeah, come back. Don't act in mime. Don't act, in, don't act in Lancer, too. Don't act wearing off on the mime. And Chakra. Yeah, dude. Coffee Break with a very surprising comeback. And those summoners have a really powerful fairy, too. So they can definitely heal themselves back up. Wow. I think both teams just have so much offense that it got to this point. It's pretty much it, just a slugfest for the most part. Slugfest. Yeah. Ah, uh, man. That's disappointing. I wanted to see Melanchthon's Iron Dragons just... See what they could do against a tankier team, uh, but yeah, they got they met another another power power team, DPS team, powerhouse. Yeah, and the speed save lance is also interesting, but but uh, yeah, I mean he, he can't take this on his own. Mm -hmm. It really only comes in like into effect in the later rounds. Like if this went on for like two minutes, the speed points really wouldn't kick in until then. Yeah. Paralyze would also prevent more speed saves from going off, so that we can just wail at him. Ooh, and a crit! <laughs> Insult. But he's dead, he's dead. I think there's a- yeah. Wow, very, very cool match 5. Very, very cool. So, Kaffe Meyer's uh, coffee break team, right? Yep. Kaffe Meyer's, and who else worked on it? Uh, it was like some guy starting with a G or something like that. I don't remember, it was like Gabadoy District or some shit. Got it, got it. Yeah. Cool team, cool team. All right. All right. See you guys for match six.